Welcome back, y'all. This is the part. This is part two of our daily routine. So, um, I ended up stopping that video and uploading in it, uploading it, and now I'm making another video. So, in between that time, um, I deleted the video and up until now, I think I deleted it. I mean, not deleted it. I'm sorry. I think I uploaded it at 3:34. It is now 4:50. Um, so, about an hour. Um, we have just been, um, just doing nothing. Uh, we got done with school. I think we got done with school before I stopped the video, but we got done with school and now I'm doing my school work. I'm about to upload a video on YouTube. Actually, I'm already on YouTube, uploaded another video about, um, the maintenance, dealing with the maintenance gaslighting me. I've been getting gaslighting since they've been working on this apartment down here. And, um, like I said, the dude downstairs started gaslighting me first and he, he has moved and he probably moved to another apartment out here because like I said, a narcissist use the things that I've said in private, um, and they say them like, or they make it happen <laughs> like, um, it's them saying it. So, um, they've been working on that apartment for, I don't know how many days, I don't know how many days the guy have, um, has moved. All I know last week is when I heard and seen the little paint and stuff out there. But I still thought that they were just, you know, touching up his apartment and, you know, giving him a little touch up. I still didn't know that he was gone until I don't know what made me know that, but I just knew. Probably because I've said that in the narcissist gaslight, you know, by me by using things that I've said and you in doing them like they said it. But anyways, I've been sitting here just um, working on my homework because I'm about to upload a video in a minute on um, narcissists and isolation, how they isolate you. Um, yeah, but I'm going to stop this video. And once I stop this video, then I'll be back with the rest of this video. So stay tuned. So, y'all, I just uploaded that video that I was telling y'all that I was making. And it's already on 85%. God is like, we're going to expose these narcissists today. Yes, we're going to do what we have to do to protect ourselves, to protect our family, to protect our children, to protect our self-worth. We are going to do what we have to do. You know what I'm saying? So, it is what it is at this time. Like, I don't have no um, guilt, no nothing about anything that's going on because... I don't deserve to be mistreated, you know, just because I don't have family or um, I'm a single mother or whatever the case may be. I don't know, but that still don't give them a right to mistreat me, especially when I'm the type of person I stay in my own lane. I don't go around picking on people, messing with people, doing any of this to, to people. If anything, I love to give compliments to people. Just like I said when I was in Alabama, I told y'all that the narcissists use things that I say and they use them. But just like I said when I was in Alabama, I got through my depression of being with a narcissist, my narcissistic ex, my, my, my narcissistic family. I got through that. That made me depressed. That gave me anxiety. I got through that by giving other people compliments. Giving other people compliments made me feel good. I felt like I was doing um, doing my job in the world to make the world a better place, okay? So, I don't go around, you know, mistreating people and making people feel small about themselves because if I make a person feel small about themselves, then how big am I if that happens? No, I'm going to keep talking and I'm going to keep speaking my truth because since you, since the narcissist want to smear my name, no, I'm going to tell my story this time. So this is me and you're going to get me. You, He can drill all he want to kind of drown me out. It doesn't matter because I'm going to speak regardless. Even if I got to pause this video, if it get too loud and come back, that's exactly what I'm going to do. Okay. So hold on. So, yeah, I'm back. He stopped drilling, so I'm going to start back talking. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm, I'm an adult. I'm not I'm not a child. You understand what I'm saying? If you want to talk, I know how to close my mouth and listen to others speak. You understand what I'm saying? I don't have to be the center of the tension because one thing about it, I know who I am. I know. I love me. Like, I have my negatives, but I also have my positives. My positives outweigh my negatives. That's what I was telling my son the other day. I know the things that I need to work on. 
I don't need nobody to keep throwing them in my face. And and not even that. They the one thing about a narcissist, they are very manipulative. They will throw just like yesterday when I told y'all I was saying I was telling my son, I corrected myself. I was like, "Hold up because I should have let you did how you wanted to do it." My bad for that cuz I was trying to control the 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 situation then. So I stepped back and I told my son, "I'm sorry." Here he go. Bam and bam and bam. You know, just gaslighting insinuating things you know what i'm saying indirectly being passive aggressive put it like that being very passive aggressive just like they are today just like they are now so um i did that and then when i made a mistake he continued to be passive aggressive so with a narcissist you have to understand you have to not give a damn about what they say what they think they nobody they're nothing Okay, so whether you're doing good or whether you're doing bad, one thing about a narcissist, you cannot please them. You cannot please a narcissist. So at the end of the day, I'm doing what's best for me because I deserve it. I'm beautiful and I make other people feel beautiful. Like I deserve everything, everything my heart desires. I'm always talking about I pray that other people get everything that their heart desire. No, I pray that I get everything that my heart desire. And guess what? If nobody else is going to make sure of that, Ranika Quinterio Quanche Williams is going to make sure of it today. Do you understand? So anyways, y'all, I just spent six minutes talking about the narcissist. Hey, y'all get to see me. Y'all get to learn about narcissists. Y'all get to learn how to cook. Y'all get to know how to be a parent. You're going to just about learn everything that you need to know from me just by watching my uh, watching my videos. So if you are new to my channel, then subscribe to my channel. If you already a subscriber, then you already know what to do. Make sure you click that notification bell so you won't miss out on all of this. You feel me? Because I know what I bring to the table, baby. And it's all good in the neighborhood. You hear me? But, yeah, y'all, it is only 5 o'clock. Like I said, Noah don't go to bed until 9 o'clock. Um, we already ate lunch. If you haven't watched the first half of our daily routine, then stop this video. And, matter of fact, yep, stop this video and go watch that video so that you can be up to date with what's going on. And I know that video is long, but trust me. It's very entertaining. I am very entertaining. So you will not be bored. Okay, so go watch that video. Then come back to this one. And you will know that we had lunch in that video. And I'm going to make dinner probably about... Hmm... Probably about 8, eight o'clock. But what I'm going to do is... I kind of messed up the black beans. So I don't really want the black beans. So I probably like start over... I know it's wasting a lot of food. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. But y'all, y'all know how I am when it comes down to flavors. I love for my food to taste good. Not that it didn't taste good, but I felt like that it could have been better. It, I couldn't even eat all my food because once I put the uh, oatmeal into the black beans and I didn't cook the black beans, it tasted different i'm just gonna say it tasted different it tasted a little bland and then i don't like the oatmeal taste that it gives without it being cooked okay it kind of remind me of pumpkin seeds and i ain't trying to eat no pumpkin seeds okay in my black beans i want my black beans so what i'll do tonight I, we still have a, a a little bit a little bit of black beans left so i will uh put those in the processor add me some more garlic Add me some more um, sage, just about everything I put in there, and um, redo it. But this time, I'm going to make sure I cook the oatmeal. So, you guys can stay tuned for that. But right now, I'm about to make my video before dinner time. As a matter of fact, I'm going to stay on here until this video is done uploading. It only took like three minutes to upload. It's done. done but yeah so any other time once we get done with school Noah will get on his tablet and do his ABC mouse 
But since I'm on his tablet, he can't really get on his tablet right now, y'all. Because so I'm, ta I'm taking over today. Like, I'm taking over. It's, it's, it's mine today. <laughs> I'm just kidding. He don't even care. He's just in his own little world like, D -d 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 let me cut this. But um, he'll normally be on his tablet um, after school. But since I'm on his tablet, mommy got to use his tablet. Then he is making his book. And we'll put his book together maybe probably tomorrow or something. But I'm just so excited that we got so much work done today. And, you know, getting work done always gives you this little feeling, this little feeling of accomplishment, you know. It make it make you feel like you special and all this stuff, which, which you are. You are really special, like like me. But, um, yeah, the maintenance man was intimidating my son. Like, he kept beating, beating, just like he was doing this morning on that video. That's what he was doing. So, you know, me, I was just really too focused on my work to even care about what they was going they was doing and so um my son was eating and when my son was sitting up on the counter when he got done eating he put his bowl in the sink you know how children is so he went to the um my baby went to the bathroom and I guess he felt like my son was being passive aggressive to him no that's your job he's seven years old what do you know about that if he know anything about that, then you teaching him how to be passive aggressive because I'm not passive aggressive. I will hit this wall and let you know that I'm hitting this wall at you. You ain't got to guess. You ain't got to feel nothing. I will come and confront you just like I did yesterday. So my baby is in the bathroom washing his hands. And as soon as my baby starts singing happy birthday, he went to beating louder like, uh-uh, no, you will not do that. You will not tear my son down. You will not do that. Oh, my God, like. A narcissist, like, the more I learn, the more I'm just like, okay, this is what it is. Like, okay, it is what it is. Like, okay, what, 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 what do you want me to do? <laughs> what do you want me to say? Like, that's your problem. That's your business. Like, you the one got to live that life, not me. Okay? So, you the one going to pay for everything that you do because... You better believe what you do to me has already been done to you. And you real reap what you sow. This world go around and around. That's why you miserable now. You understand? And I said that last night in my video. That's why so many people are miserable because they sit and they hate on other people. Stop hating on people, bro. Stop hating. Go out and give people compliments and do something. And I said the same thing in Alabama and I'm going to say it again in Naples, Florida. Go out and make the world a better place. Stop trying to bring people down. Okay? Especially me because I ain't do nothing to you. At all. But it's cool. Because I'm going to use that as fruit. Y'all already know me. I'm very resilient. Anything that the devil throw at me, guess what? Oh, and I smell the good scent from the Lord. The Lord is my shepherd. I shall not want. He makes me to lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside the still water. He restores my soul. He leads me in the path of righteousness for his name's sake. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. For thou art with me. Thy rod, thy staff, they comfort me. Thou preparest a table before me in the presence of my enemies. Thou anoints my head with oil, my cup runneth over. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life. And I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Just like I said, I'm going to continue to love, baby. I wouldn't look good if I didn't. Period. Y'all think that it be the physical appearance? No, baby. It's how you treat people. It's how you, how you, how you love, how you act. That's what makes me beautiful. God just so happened to make me beautiful on the outside as well because he already knew who I was going to be. He already know who I am. Period. Poo. I'm going to continue to love. I'm going to continue to speak joy. I'm going to continue to speak my, tell my story. I don't care how much a narcissist lose control. No, you're not going to stop me from talking. Not this time. Fool me once. Shame on me. Fool me twice. Sh shoot, fool me once. Shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on me. So get it. <laughs> Anyways, y'all, my, my video is done uploading. So I am about to make my video. So yeah, stay tuned for the rest of this video, though. Peace until next time, y'all.
So what's up y'all? I just got finished making my YouTube video. How do a narcissist isolate you? And this is the living room. So Noah is cleaning up. I'm gonna go use the bathroom because I gotta pee. And then I'm going to make dinner. So stay tuned for the rest of the video. Uh, 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 uh. I know y'all didn't think it was over. Did you? Did you? Did you? Did you? Did you? I think the fuck not. Peace. Huh. <laughs> now, ladies and gentlemen, let's get ready to. Let me stop. Bye. All right, y'all. So as you know, earlier I made us some um. I'm sorry, I'm smelling it. I made us some, um, I think I'm going to throw it away. Uh, I made us some, um, black bean burgers. Going to throw it away, okay? Because there's nothing I can do to save you, okay? So, something like a narcissist, I got to throw them away. Okay? I can't save you. I can't save this. What can I do to save this? I don't like that the oatmeal is not cooked. I should have cooked the oatmeal. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the Liberty Black Beans that I have in the pot already. And I'm going to blend them up. But I'm going to cook the oatmeal first. And I'm just going to try it again. I'm going to be like Ali and dust yourself off and try again. You can dust it off and try again. Try again. Yeah. And the first you don't succeed, no, you can, I can, you don't want to run all of my, I may be shy on the first day, what about the next day, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh. no, you don't want to run all of my, I may be shy on the first day, what about the next day, tablet 
I dreamed about my cousin Sean and my um cousin CP last night. Oh y'all, it was a bad dream though. I had a dream that, but this is this dream let me know who's protecting me. I always pay attention to my dream. Damn, I thought this milk was gonna fall, y'all. Oh, I, I, I had a falling out the bed moment, but not really falling. But um, that what I get for playing with ghosts. <laughs> It was a net flew by me. <laughs> I was playing with the net. But um um in my dream, right, it was me, Sean, and CP, my cousins. And um we was just chilling doing our thing or whatever, and we end up at a house. I don't know who house it was. I should have looked up why I dreamed about the house though, because I know that was a very important and I dreamed about a river or a canal. So I, I have to look look that up. Um, but it's water, so I could be just cleansing. It should be it could could be like cleansing and safe. You feel safe because it's a house. A house makes you feel safe. And water is like cleansing. So that's probably what that meant. But anyway, let me get back to the dream. The dream part was good. So we get to the house, but then the house turned out to be a jail. And me and CP, we go back here. While Shun talking to the people at the door, which turned out to be the front desk of the hospital, I don't know how the house turned into the jail, but it did. Once we, mm, I get that. The house turned into the jail, and then me and CP, we went to one of the rooms, which turned out to be uh, uh, the, the jail cell. And in the jail cell, it was just a lot of disgusting people, like retarded people like they were slobbing up <laughs> i'm so sorry but this is what i dream so they was just i'm trying to think were they retarded or were they just evil people either way i was scared put it like that and um my cousin cp she wasn't cautious but that's how she's always been growing up like her antennas don't raise not saying that as an insult i'm saying that because my cousin cp is very loving she's a very trusting person like oh my god she will help you to the end of the earth and you know you get you get fucked over dealing with a narcissist especially when you're like that so she just went in that bitch and sat down but that's her that's her character she don't judge you she don't do any of that. CP, she never judge you, never do any of those things. That's why when I spoke to her back when I was working, she made me feel bad because my cousin, um, my baby cousin, Mari, she admired me. And CP said something like indirectly or passive aggressive. And I was like, what do I do like that? I turned it kind of into a joke. You feel me? But um, I know that she's being manipulated as well because she's so loving. So she just went straight in. And you know me, I'm like looking like, mm-mm. But so then by the time I can sit down, Sean getting arrested by the police. So I was like, bitch, I'm about to go. I'll jump out the window. Tell me how I get out the prison balls. Bitch, I got out them balls. Like, fuck out of here. You ain't finna hold me. You ain't finna hold a real nigga down. And she was like, you finna escape? I was like, bitch, you better come on. So we ended up jumping out the fucking window and hitting it. And then that's how we got got to the canal. We ran past the canal. It's like a little apartment building on that side right there. And then she was like, the police coming. The police was coming towards us. So we had to go and hide in, in, in one of the apartment buildings and stuff. And um, the police pull up with Sean in the back of the car. And Sean looking so sad. And um, the police trying to make me surrender because CP doesn't surrender, but I didn't surrender. And um, just a look in my cousin Sean's face, I end up, um, you know, surrendering. We went to jail. Bitch, you know that was a dream because I ain't going to never. Like, <laughs> you got me fucked up, especially if I ain't do nothing. We just went to the damn house. How did we end up in jail? We ain't do shit. But anyways, y'all, let me get to this food. I've been talking to y'all all day. And I'll be back with the rest of this video. I'm going to move y'all to probably over there. So, baby, if you can unplug the charger. Did you bring me the milk? Yeah, he brought me the milk. I thought the milk failed. Okay. 
So let me hold it so it won't come out. Thank you. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. ah! Let me pause, y'all. Look, y'all, I thought I had done um, pause it. I was ready to dance. I'm... Oh. But I'm finna um, throw this away. And I'm gonna get the black beans from my crock pot. And I'm just gonna redo everything that I did today. So stay tuned. Okay, y'all, so since we don't have anything but like a handful of black beans, we got like a little change of pace. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to make us a salad. I'm going to make us a black bean salad with some mushrooms and some spinach. So I'm going to saute the mushrooms and everything, and I'm going to put the tomato juice inside of it. I'm just going to put all of it together. That's what I'm going to do. Or maybe I can we can just top our salad with it. But I know for sure I'm going to cook that spinach. I'm not eating that spinach like that. But I'm going to make some dishwater first so that I can kind of like clean and cook at the same time. Because the kitchen is really dirty. So yeah, stay tuned for the rest of this video. Hopefully I can be done cooking by 9 o'clock. Because no one going to bed at 9 o'clock. So stay tuned. I was your lover and your secretary. Working every day of the week. Was at the job when no one else was there. Helping you can hug your feet. It left the years of sacrifice. And you can let me at the drop of a dime. Swallow my fears. Stood by your side. I should have left you as a thousand times. Hey, hey. Again and again and again And I should've been gone, oh no No, no, no I'm not gonna cry It's not worth the time What you gotta do? Oh, oh, oh I'm not gonna share the tears that you like I'm not gonna cry Oh, oh I said I can do that for her as you were never worth my tears No, I'm not gonna cry As you're not worth my tears I know there are no guarantees In love, you'll take your chances But somehow it seems unfair to me Look at your circumstances Through sickness and hell To tap to us part And those were the words that we said from my heart So now when you say that you're leaving me I don't get that oh. I fucked up <laughs> Okay, y'all, so I just thought about that I did not take um, anything out to cook for tomorrow. So that's another thing about eating healthy. You have to be up on your game. <laughs> like, you can't be waiting around for, you know, thinking about what you're going to cook. Because I was going to make chickpeas, but my chickpeas have to soak for like 10 to 11 hours. I can't do that. Because I want to be able to put the food on before I go to bed tonight so that it can be ready in the morning. I don't want to have to wait all day to eat like I did the other day. So, since I can't make the chickpeas, I'm just going to make black beans. And this time, I'm going to make it like... You, you ever had um, tomato and rice, sauce, sausage with tomato and rice? So good. I'm going to make it like that. I'm going to put some black, I'm going to use my black beans, cut up some tomatoes, and I'm going to use some quinoa. It's going to be so good. So stay tuned. It's not going to be done tonight though, but I'll make a video tomorrow let y'all know how it is. So um, stay tuned for the rest of this video though. So y'all, this is what we have having tonight. Just some spinach with black beans and mushrooms and I'm gonna top it off with some um tomatoes that I, I tried to make into ketchup um uh, earlier today I we don't have any more bread and it's going to take forever to cook the bread like I said when you're eating healthy yeah. you have to be prepared you can't just okay just leave it there baby I'll get it you have to be prepared so we're going to eat this tonight I'll probably give him a fruit to go with it to kind of like fill them up and um 
Yeah, hopefully we get full. I know I'm not going to get full, but... Mm. This is really good. And the mushrooms are delicious. Oh, okay, I'm going to taste the mushrooms, mommy. So we just got an hour. Noah just got an hour before his bedtime. cups of chickpeas and it was way more than black bean. Well I threw a lot of black beans away. I did. So tomorrow I'm gonna cook the black beans and I'm gonna make it like tomatoes and rice with sausage, but we're going to have black beans, tomato, quinoa, and I'm going to top it off with some mushrooms. Mm. This spinach is good. Did I say that? It's so good. Ah, it's hot too. The food is yummy. Yummy, yummy. In my tummy. Mm. Papa like spinach. Good. So next time I go to the store, instead of getting kale, I'm gonna get spinach. But kale is good too. That was garlic, y'all. Yeah. That was like a whole piece of garlic. See mushroom, mommy? Hmm? See mushroom. Yeah. Mm. I just remembered I had that kale. I'm trying. I'm thinking of ways to incorporate it into my black beans. I might do that.
Every so I ate three mushrooms. Got another one. I think we had the same amount of mushrooms. Cause I cooked a lot. I ain't put enough mushrooms in that um in my black bean oh in my black bean burger. So I made up for it in that. So what I'm gonna cook tomorrow is my black beans. I'm gonna put some kale in there. And um tomatoes and quinoa that should be a great meal and I'm gonna put it on before I go to bed tonight I'm letting my beans um, clean cleaning my beans oh. where's my water Y'all, hot water tastes so good. I like cold water too, but it depends like when I want cold water. He going to get my water. Cold water is good too, but it depends on, you know, my mood. If it's cold in the house, I don't really want cold water. And sometimes I just don't want it because it cold my mouth. And I prefer room temperature water, not hot water, but room temperature. And besides with cold water, I can't drink, like drink it for real, unless I'm hot, unless I've been outside running or something like that. But um, other than that, I'll just sip it. And then it'll it'll get it'll get hot anyways because I can't drink it. And then when it get hot, then that's when I gonk it, gonk it, gonk it. But I'm gonna let him finish eating. I'll probably get me a snack. I'll probably get me a fruit or something because I'm still hungry. I'll probably get me a fruit. I'm almost done. I love eating healthy, but it's it's not it's not enough food to eat healthy. It's really not. I'm still gonna make that video. I haven't forgotten to make that video. I'm just gonna have to tell you guys what we ate. Done. Put your ball in the same boat. And I guess we can play a game. If you can go get your sight words, we can play a game with that. Or matter of fact, just get your adjectives. And your verbs. So we'll play a game until it's time for him to go to bed. So, uh, yeah, I'll bring y'all in the uh, living room with First, let's talk about which, what, what each of them are. So you're standing in front of the adverb. So what is an adverb? An adverb, what, what to tell you how, how something happens. How something happens. Okay? Happens. Like, uh, the father was... Playfully. Playing with the children playfully. That's how he was playing playfully, okay? Nouns. What is a noun? A person plays a thing. Don't step on them. What is a verb? What makes a noun do something? <laughs> what is an adjective? You almost failed. That's what you get. What? What describes the noun? Right. Describes. Describes. Okay. All right. So now that we know what they are let's let's play yeah let's see let me find some let's words let's get on guys let's find some words okay so the first word is angry mm -hmm. the mother was very angry at the child the mother was very angry at the child. Hey, good job. It's an adjective. Good job. Flowers. 
I like flowers. I like flowers. I'm, I'm, I'm going to stay quiet until you get it right. Ding, ding, ding. Don't step on them. Ding, ding, ding. All right. Moo. The cow went moo. The cow went moo. The cow went moo. Ding, ding, ding. The cow is doing something. What is the cow doing? Moo. Moo. Okay. Um, rudely, the mother was acting rudely, rudely, the mother was acting rudely, very good, it's an adverb, good job, all right, let's pause, it's big, big, all right, Frogs. The frogs are ugly. The frogs are ugly. The frogs are ugly. The frogs are ugly. What is a frog? A noun. Go sit over there, dude. Ding, ding, ding. Play. I love to play. I love to play. I love to play. Apparently, you love to play too. Quietly. The boy walked quietly. The boy walked quietly. Quietly. The boy walked quietly. All right. Ding, ding, ding. Bitter. The lemon is bitter. The lemon is bitter. Bitter lemon. The lemon is bitter. Ding, ding, ding. You remember doing these? You remember doing these? Yes. <laughs> Let me switch it up then. Hold up, y'all. Let's get started. All right. So jumping. The frog is jumping. The frog is jumping right. Book. The book is big. The book is big. What is a book? A book is something you read. Person, place, and thing. Right. It's a thing. It's a noun. All right. Uh, let's see. Worked. I worked hard today. I worked hard today. I worked hard today. I can understand why you think that, but it's not that. I worked hard today. Right, because what did you do? I worked hard. You worked. I worked. True. The woman is true. The woman Speak real sh- No, just play. The woman is true. True. The mother is true. True. Think about it. Wait, wait. Just stop and think. What is true? If the woman is true... What is true doing? True doing is. Why you keep looking over there? Um, but I think it's that. Then is you right? It's that one. It's describing the woman, right? Yeah. 
clever. The boy is clever. Clever. The boy is clever. Now, if you're going to sit here and play with me, I'm going I'm to stop the game. And you could just go to bed now. Okay, go to the one. Go. What is clever? Clever is something you do. No. Try again. Clever is... Because right now, I feel like you're playing with me, Noah. What is clever, Noah? Stop playing. Clever is... If the boy is clever, what is clever in that sentence? Clever. Clever is. Okay, I ain't got time. All right, y'all. We're going to end this game because now Noah want to be clever. So we're going to end this game. Y'all, so I'm sitting here, right? I'm laying up under my little dining room table thing my little bar thing right here I'm laying up under here right and so I see something white I'm like what is it look bruh look look at that look at it you see it? you see that bruh some nasty motherfucker left their gum underneath my damn thing Nasty ass motherfuckers. I told y'all that these narcissists are disgusting. You hear me? Look, this is the proof. Let me make sure y'all can see it. This is the damn proof. That's gum, bruh. That's gum. You already know how a motherfucker feel. Motherfucker do some nasty ass shit like that. That's gum. Somebody done chewed that shit and stuck that shit under there. It's gum, bruh. You already know how a person feel about you if they do some nasty ass shit like that. And the only people who did that shit was maintenance. So tell me I'm bugging. Bruh, that's nasty as shit. I'm going to keep that there because I'm going to make a video of it tomorrow. I'm going to let y'all know. Like, You see a person inside, but how the way they act. Ben left a gum under there. What if my son would have took that gum and ate that shit, bro? You, you know I'm coming because you know who this apartment belonged to. So you already know. they Now everything that I'm saying is just coming together, bro. A bit of gum under my damn, under my damn um, counter. Gum, bro. So you knew I was coming. You knew this. So... Everything that I've been saying about the narcissist in Alabama telling the Section 8 office, Section 8 office here, I mean, they're telling here, and Joanne ass telling the damn lady Chelsea. All this shit been planned, bruh. You could tell the person inside by how they act, bruh. Narcissists are disgusting. Do you hear me? D fucking disgusting. And I'm gonna make I'm gonna leave it there until um I make a video of it tomorrow. Like that's disgusting. I'm just laying here, you know, just watching on on my phone, watching on YouTube until you know the alarm go off so Noah can take him bath. And I look, I'm like, what the fuck is that? So I look to the other side to see if it was on the other side, because I'm like, is that a nail or something? Maybe it's a white nail. So I looked on the other side to see, and it's 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 not. It's just a little white piece of paint that I thought was, you know, that, but it's not. Bruh, this is how a person, this is a person inside. This is how they feel. That's nasty as fuck. Why would you do that? Only people do that is disgusting ass motherfuckers. And just like I said, narcissists are disgusting as hell, bruh. You can't make me think I'm crazy because I see all the fucking signs. I see all the fucking patterns. Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on me. Nah, bro, I ain't going. And I'm going to leave that shit right there because I'm going to make a whole video around that little nasty-ass gum right there, bro. 
You stick some gum up on the bitch shit. Just like they left that shit outside my door. You see a person insides. By the shit they do, you see a person insides, bro, and they disgusting as hell, bro. All right, that's all I wanted to tell y'all. That shit, that's nasty as hell. That shit could have fell on my motherfucking face, bro. And they got that shit up there. But I'm going to keep this video going until um, Noah get in the tub. He about to, the alarm about to go off in a minute. It should go off in a minute. Let me see what time is it. 8.48. That's how you know, bro. Motherfucker just disgusting. Motherfucker ain't got, a motherfucker ain't shit. Motherfucker be trying to be reasonable with a narcissist, but you can't because they disgusting as hell. Why would you leave gum under a bitch shit? I ain't even do shit to you. I don't even know you, bro. I've never met you and you've never met me. Never. And you've never met me. But just off what you hear, because I know it's the maintenance people who did it, because they're the only ones coming to your apartment and work on your shit just like they working on the apartment downstairs. I don't even know you. And you disrespect me, bro. People, narcissists, boy. They ain't no damn good. Let me tell y'all. Y'all stay away from them people. They don't mean you no good. But let me save the rest of this video for my son. I'll be back with the rest of this video. Okay, y'all. So, it is 8 o'clock. And um, Noah is in the bathroom getting ready for bed. And I'm about to get ready for bed as well. But... Noah's phone is going dead and I'm using the charger. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to end this video so that he can get the charger. So I want to say thank you for watching this video. Thank you for spending the day with us. Um, we love you. If you are new, join. If you are ready, then you know what to do. Um, yeah, and love yourself. And I'll be back tomorrow with more videos. So stay tuned for that. Peace until next time.